Hi. <laughs> so today we're doing this like fun Q&A rapid fire questions with Miss Anastasia. Right? Yeah. Are you ready? Yeah. This is meant to be fun. There's no right or wrong answers, by the way. Uh, so what we're going to do is the game is not really a game, but it's just like rapid fire <laughs> Q&A. Basically, like I, she, she wrote down questions, and I have to answer them like on the spot. Yeah. So this is unrehearsed. She doesn't know what these questions are gonna be. I'm nervous. <laughs> Why are you nervous? It's well, not... I'm not nervous, but I'm just like I don't know what the questions are gonna be. <laughs> <laughs> but you don't have to worry. Okay. So I'm okay. gonna. And if there are any questions that you're uncomfortable answering, um, answer them anyway. <laughs> I thought you were gonna be like, if there's if there's any answers you're uncomfortable with answering, you can skip them. No, no, no you're gonna answer. <laughs> okay, all right, ready? Okay. Okay. Anastasia, what's the meaning of your name? Um, my name means resurrection, but you chose it because like. Anastasia and Stacy and are kind of similar. Yes, my name comes from Anastasia. Little, little known fact. Okay. We decided to put a mic on her because I don't know. I, I feel like I have a new iPhone and for some reason this iPhone picks up a lot of like ambient noise or something. And I don't know if I can get rid of it in editing. So sorry for the confusion there. So let us pick up where we left off. Okay. Oh gosh. What is. Okay, hold on. I got to get back into the phone because I'm reading the questions from here. All right. So, okay. Next question. Who's your role model? Zendaya. Or you. Oh, uh, you no, too. that's fine. That's fine. No, it's okay. you too because like I remember I used to want to be a news anchor when I grew up. I'm not a news anchor, but. Close. That yeah, weather, oh. weather. <laughs> yes. But I but yeah, you're my role model too. Oh, it's okay. It's fine. Why is Zendaya your role model? Because I think we have a lot in common with like wanting to act and we I used to dance like she does. I'm not really into the singing part, but still. <laughs> okay. Why am I a role model again? Uh, <laughs> because I think I think you're very natural, and I want to be like I want to be able to sound like you when I'm doing interviews. <laughs> you see, but you said it like natural. Just be you. Just be natural. Yeah. And you never have to. You're very confident too. Oh, so that's good. <laughs> yes, that's what we're working on. Confidence so important. I'm confident too. Though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Don't get me wrong. Get her in front of the camera. Oops, wait, O'Shea, wait. He's getting out of the shower. Okay, we don't want that. <laughs> no, you're not on. That's, that's, that's her, her little brother. Okay. All right. What grade are you in? Six. Six, okay. That's a good grade. What's your favorite subject? Oh, God. ELA. ELA. What is ELA for those who may not know? English language arts. Why do you like that subject? I I think it helps me with my, like, memorizing and stuff that has to do with acting, like my speaking. Yes. And you read a lot? Yeah. I, I read in every single subject today in school. Like out loud? Yeah. Oh. What book are you reading right now? In ELA, we're reading Percy Jackson, The Lightning Thief. Ooh. Yeah. What's the last book? you read that didn't have anything to do with school? Wish. What is that? It's, that. it's a book about this girl named Charlie, and she, ha she finds this stray dog after she moved to a new place with her aunt and her uncle after her mom and dad have, like, a lot of family issues going on. Oh, that sounds like it's really deep. It was good. Oh, okay. And she makes like this wish every single day for the same thing. And at the end, uh, I'm not going to spoil it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Don't spoil it. Okay. For anyone who's reading it, if <laughs> <Okay>. you are. <laughs> okay. What do you like to do for fun? I like to do gymnastics. I like to cook. And like, I also do arts and crafts. I'm not as like artsy as my brother. Like, 
Yeah, he's pretty art. He is very good. I just do it for fun. I like doing the craft part more than the art part. <laughs> but you're good. You're good too. Yeah. Um, so what do you do to relax? Hmm. Watch TV. <laughs> Sometimes I stretch because it like, I think it just makes my muscles less tense. So like, I also meditate sometimes. How do you meditate? Rel relaxation, like. Take deep breaths. Yeah, and like um, do different movements with my body. Yeah. Like what I learned in acting classes. Oh, okay, all right, okay. Oh, favorite food? Pasta. Of course. Why am I not surprised? <laughs> uh, what's your favorite color? Light blue and light pink and lavender. I said color, not colors. Obviously. Okay, light, <laughs> light blue. It's okay, it's okay. Sometimes we have more than one. Okay. Yeah. Um, if you could be anywhere in the world, where would you want to be? Like on vacation or live? If you could be anywhere in the right now, if you could snap your fingers and you could be anywhere in the world, where would that California. be? California. Why? Because it's just so warm and nice. I know. And like, no, no. I just want to live there. <laughs> Maybe one day, right? One yeah. day. All right. Um, if you could have lunch with anyone in history, who would that be? Um, anyone in history? God, that's a hard question. <laughs> well, it could be today. They could be living. They don't have to be. Probably, probably Zendaya again. <laughs> I say not you because I already go out to lunch with you. <laughs> Okay, well, Zendaya, if you watch it, girl, hook a sister up, right? Okay. Um, okay, where did I leave off? Uh, what is your favorite childhood memory? Uh, you're still a child, we yeah. know, but what's your favorite memory so far? If it, it could be anything. Gosh, I don't know. Um, you're not going to find it up there. I know, it's just I'm trying to remember. <laughs> I know, no. Uh, my favorite funny memory was when we were in Jamaica and then the rat came in the room <laughs> <laughs> and then I started screaming and yeah. That was a funny one. We yeah. got a lot of flack for that on social media. Yeah. But um but that was but you know the but you understand why we we visited, right? It was yeah. to you. It's about learning about who you are, where you come from, because in order to know where you're going, mm. you have to know what, where you started. Yes, and that's where our family started. Well, we started in Africa, but that's where we're from. So yeah. that was a whole other. But lesson. the rest of the vacation was really good, <laughs> and like. We didn't ditch our uncle or anything. Like, no. we still hang out with him for the rest of the trip. Yeah, people thought we were, like, being super mean. We're yeah. not being mean. It's just, that was just a part of the experience. And, um, and we love him. We love him. Yeah. And he's great. And we had fun. All right. So, okay, where did I leave off? Okay. So that was your favorite childhood memory. <laughs> okay. Um, I, the, that I can think of at the moment. Yeah. So we're going to do another part of this. Um, interview where you're going to complete each sentence, right? Okay. Rapid fire, complete each sentence. Okay. My favorite movie is? Remember the Titans. When I grow up, I want to be a? Actress and model. I'm happiest when? Uh... <laughs> I'm happiest when? When I'm with the people I love. I'm upset when? You repeat things over and over again. <laughs> My favorite parent is? Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of question is that? That was a trick question. Okay. Um, <laughs> yeah, right. You wanted me to answer that. <laughs> Remember what I said. Answer everything. Um, okay, so... <laughs> okay, all right. Both of you guys, <laughs> like me. I feel inspired when? Mm, when I feel like I've done something right. 
Okay. What is your... Yes. I didn't ask you this. So let's go back for a second. What is the biggest accomplishment you feel you've had thus far in life? Mm. It could be school related. It could be an activity. It could be a personal goal. Probably either booking all my modeling jobs that I've had or getting like the best grades I've ever gotten this year. Yeah. Oh, what was your average? What did you, what was your My point? average was like a 96 or something. Yeah. Which was pretty Principal, good. what is it called? Principal's Pr list? Yeah, what? I got the principal's list and I got, uh, I qualified for the National Junior Honor Society. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, my, my biggest challenge is? Probably trying to book an acting job. Um, but that... That won't be a challenge anymore, hopefully. Okay. Did you say I'm inspired when? Did I ask you that? Yeah. When I, like, when I achieve something okay. or... Yeah. I feel most proud when... Not a trick question. I know. It's just, like, it's hard. Hmm... Probably when I feel like I've accomplished something and like when I feel that, I don't know, I, I feel like I've changed. In what I way? Guess. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> These are hard questions. These are not hard questions. Okay. Um, what is your goal this year? Or goals. I, I think one one. my number one goal is to book, like, a speaking role in acting, like, as a guest star or, like, supporting character or to, like, get better at my gymnastics and post more on my social media. Oh, social media, huh? Okay. Yeah, it's just, like, I need more ideas. Yeah. So if you have any ideas for if you want me for videos you want me to post on my Instagram, comment down below or my YouTube channel. Comment down <laughs> below. <laughs> okay, we're gonna now one last thing. Is there anything that I didn't ask you that you wish I would have asked you? Hmm. Or anything you want the people to know at home? Um I know there's something. There's something. Yeah. So we got some things that we're working on that you're looking to accomplish. You're going to yeah. speak it into existence, right? We'll yeah. manifest that. Yeah. And what are you doing to work towards your goals? You Going to acting classes. Um, have like working hard in my auditions and trying to um getting better at memorizing scenes and stuff like that and how has that helped you with school has it yeah because oh, okay. like in the beginning of the year my social studies and ela grade was like average like 80 something 83 or something and now I bumped up like seven, seven or nine points, and now I have oh. ninety something. And it, I think oh. my memorizing helped me with like really? vocabulary and stuff like that. To Were there any other obstacles that um, made you not get good grades in the beginning of the year or last year? <laughs> I was on my phone a lot. <laughs> yes. So we had to take away some of the electronics. So. Notes to parents, really, really monitor how much exposure these kids have online. That's some, something that we are working on. So she doesn't have her phone anymore. And we're working towards that. We'll see how that goes. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. You want to, you want to, any more parting words that you want to share? Make sure you subscribe to her channel and my channel if you want more videos and turn on the post notifications so you know uh, when we upload and 
Have a good day. Bye. Or night. Oh, night. Bye. Bye.